Hey coaches, Dan here from Coach Calls Timeout. Welcome to day one of your 30 day fitness challenge. We're all stuck indoors right now with this coronavirus pandemic. We're gonna get through this together and we're gonna be fit when it's all said and done. So 15 minute workout, upper body workout coming to you. Two minutes of warm up, 15 minutes of workout. Get back out and play with your kids. Get back watching TV, whatever you were doing before. Let's do it. I'll start the timer. 30 seconds jog on the spot. I wish I had a whistle. <laughs> jog on the spot, let's go. So upper body workouts, we're gonna wanna get a good sweat going for this warm up. full disclosure. I'm already out of breath because this is take five of the warm up portion of this video, high knees. And my calves are burning. Jumping jacks. This is why they're burning. I don't have a lot of room here. So hopefully you can find a spot with a little more room where you can get that good range of motion going on your shoulders. Because we're going to be doing a lot of shoulder work here. Reach up above your head. Now we're gonna do jumping jacks, arms out. I can't really reach out. If I knock off that wee, my kids will not be happy. So I'm gonna do it with elbows bent. Try to get maximum range on the shoulders. Now we're gonna do lunges. Reach up, reach up. Throw in a shot, right hand, left hand, right hand, left hand. Leave a comment, how's my form? Right hand, left hand. Focus on those lunges and the form if you want to. Have some fun. Now we're gonna get into push-ups. Just gonna be set to 20 seconds. The repetitions aren't as important. Just gonna go at your own pace for 20 seconds. Arms, shoulder width apart. Now we're gonna rest for 20. So the goal of this fitness challenge it's not just all physical. Why am I so out of breath? This is going to be a rough one. The goal is not all physical. We're going to be doing a lot of other stuff as well. Push-ups. Make sure you're breathing. Don't forget to breathe. Rest for 20. Think about, we're going to try to rest our mind when we rest and focus on our muscles while we're working out, while we're doing the reps. So next time we rest, next we're going to do push ups with one leg up. Okay? So pick your left leg first up. If you need to go to one knee, do that as well. No problem, this is to do it at your own pace so that you not only get through it, but tomorrow you want to do more. Rest. Let's think about that time when you actually got a favorable call from the referee. How surprised you were, how good it felt. Now, next. Other leg in the air. How are you feeling? I'm feeling it. It's gonna be a good workout. 
It's gonna give you lots of oxygen to your brain. You're gonna have so much patience for the rest of the day. No problem. Next, starting downward dog. We're just gonna come down. Stretch out your arms back down and push up to downward dog. Back down to your stomach. Raise your back. And push up. And raise your rest. Take deep breaths. After this next one, we're going to take a one minute rest. Grab a drink of water. You can hit pause. Go grab some water. Come on back. See if you can get two full. Back down, up, and a push up. And there we go. Now let's rest for one minute. I'll put up something fun on the screen for you while I sit here and have a drink. I'm not taking more than one minute. I promise you, I'm doing this together with you. I'm going to struggle with you. Feel your heart beating. Take a deep breath. For 10 seconds. Next we're gonna do triceps. Not as much activity in this one. It's kind of just what you're able to do. Your butt down. Bring yourself up and really lock it at the top. Get that tricep burning. And rest. How are you feeling? Everything good? Good. We're gonna get through this together. 30 days from now, we're all gonna be much better for this. Get ready for the next set of triceps and then we'll move on to something different. Really lock it at the top. Try to keep your midsection tight as well. And rest. So next we're gonna get into kind of the downward dog position again. Butt in the air. We're gonna do what's called pike push-ups. So, might as well get down there now. And then, back straight, push up, push up. So at your own pace, if you find this difficult on your shoulders, then don't do it. Adjust, do something different. The goal of these workouts throughout the 30 days is not to kill you, not to make you sore, it's to make you want to come back tomorrow and do more. Yeah, it kind of rounds. You should write that down. Okay, last set of pipes. Butt in the air, back straight. Five seconds. That's it. You won't have to do any more pike push-ups. Next one's probably the hardest thing we have left. So get ready, and then we're going to take a break after two sets. Okay? Okay, we're going to push-up. A walk-out push-up. 
Okay, walk it out with your arms as far as you can. My shoulders are kind of shot, so I can't really go too far out. Can you get out there and do a push up? And rest. I went a little over on that one. Deep breaths, make sure you're breathing while you're doing all of this as well. Helps the recovery period. And last one, walk out that push up. Hopefully, you're smarter than me. You don't have slippers on. I feel like I'm gonna fall flat on my face. <laughs> One minute rest. Go grab a drink. Ten more seconds. Sorry, I kind of blacked out there. I needed to rest. Get some breathing in. So we're gonna do arms out on your butt, head up. We're gonna push, push ourselves with our elbows and our arms. Get a good back workout. And rest. Make sure you breathe. Feel the good energy that's going into you. And release all the toxic out. Okay, arms out. Hands up. Really push into the ground with your elbows. For all those coaches who were shooters back in the day, Maybe you got a bit of shooter's elbow. This might not feel good, but you'll manage. And rest. Next one, we're going to break up into 10 seconds. That gets just easier. Maybe we'll switch it left, right, left, right. This is day one. I'm kind of figuring it out as we go. Really engage your core. And rest. We'll do one more set of that. And then we're down to our last exercise. No problem, right? 15 minutes in and out. Kids haven't even knocked on the door yet. Right, left. You don't want to turn your body too much on this. Try to keep your shoulders square, chest square to the ground, and rest. Now on this last one, we're going to stand up. Hopefully, he won't get as dizzy as I am. We do. Little arm curls with resistance. And that's it. Be no rest on this. So, with your left arm, pull your right arm down. You're going to try to get those biceps curl, bicep curls going. Straighten up your back. Switch. We'll rest on this one. 
rest is when your other arm's doing nothing. Give me your ugliest workout faces. Oh. We have two more sets left. Two more. We can do it. Let's go. Pull, resist. Pull, resist. Back straight. Last one. Come on. This is the last one. Just like when you're telling the kids during their suicides. Last sprint. Go hard. Go hard. And we're done. Shake it out. Shake out the body. That's it, day one is done.